Sara Kellis? Yes? I have evidence you've been sabotaging the Nexus. What? No, I've never... I've been looking into this myself. I have the scans to prove it. Here, I'll transfer the scans I took to your Omni-Tool. Funny. Raj was investigating the same thing, and it led us to you. My scans point at Raj as the one. So unless someone was setting us both up, I just don't understand. So it was Raj. This callus has accumulated is strangely similar to Mr. Patel's. A third party seems likely. Decoy tactic. You've been set up. The real saboteur could be setting you both up. Because we both figured out something was going on? That would make sense. It's better than thinking Raj could have done this. But it means all the data I have is useless. Wish I had access to the security cams. I bet we could find something there. You stay put, so whoever did this doesn't realize we're onto them. I'll check out the security cams. And Raj, now. Is he there? Yes. How did it go? Is it. Is it really her? Wasn't her. She had proof pointing at you. I figure someone's been messing with you both. Just keep a low profile and don't talk to anyone. I'm on it. Alright. Lanny. Pathfinder. Good to see you. Word is there's been trouble on the station. Uh, where'd you hear that? We just got here. How did you know that already? Word gets around. Does it now? People talk to me? Anyway. To as soon as we establish outposts, everything will even out. I'm sure of it. Alright, talk to you later. Have to go now. See you later. Take care. Wait, what are these little stutters? <laughs> like, I saw her... Unless I'm seeing something, her, shutter, her shoulders just pop up and down in an instant. Alright, now we have to... Access the... Actually, let's visit uh, my brother. Cryo Bay, Docking Bay. Operations. Let's go to a Cryo Bay. And there's a new quest. All right, what do you have? Oh no, wait, it's over here. I'll make it right, Dash. I promise. Uh huh. Pathfinder, I'm Nigel McCoy. Just got out of cryo. Welcome to Andromeda, Nigel. Thank you. It's bittersweet, though. My little brother Dash was stationed on the Nexus. I just learned he died on Eos, trying to start a settlement. Oh. He's a hero. Don't say that. That's awful. I'm sorry, Nigel. Yeah. We were gonna start families out here together. I have a pendant our father wore. Dash had its match. Will you... Reunite them. Of course. In his digital journal, he mentioned a spot on Eos where he'd go to think. If you could leave the pendant there. I will honor it. Mike's feeling a little better. Hey, Fisher. The good news is the bone didn't break. I'm sure the bastards were getting around to it. Fisher, glad to see you're doing better. That was some expedition, hey? Captain said I'm going in the log as the first human to make contact with the K. And Kirkland's the first casualty. Wish it could have gone differently. The cat are to blame. Wasn't your fault. It's obvious the cat aren't friendly. Nothing we did could have changed that. I suppose you're right. It's just not what you dream about. You meet a new species, and three seconds later they're trying to kill you. I hear you, but I guess that's life. Not everyone will see things our way. In the meantime, chin up. It'll get better. Hope. Hey, Doctor. Ryder, good to see you. Damn shame about your dad, though. I'm sorry we couldn't save him. How did he die? I haven't heard how he died. Like a hero. That's how. That's the only part that matters. I've met one Pathfinder. Well, two with you. But I figure that's the way to go. Taking your last breath on an uncharted world. Yeah, sounds like 
Sounds about right. Now I just need to make sure your brother here pulls through. How's my brother? How's Scott doing? His condition's stable. I see signs of REM activity in the brain, so he's dreaming. Means all the wiring still works. How did this happen? It was dumb luck, really. We hit the scourge at the worst possible moment. Just as the stasis revival was kicking in. It's a vulnerable moment, coming out of a 600-year nap, then wham! The circuits fried and overloaded the neural pathways. Don't worry, I'm on it. We're not losing another rider. Thank you. That's all, Harry. Thanks. Don't be a stranger. If anything changes with Scott, I'll let you know. I'm guessing this is Scott. Hey, you look like Donnie Yen. <laughs> well, sweet. Hayes. Ryder. Hayes, how's the wound? Doc says I'll live. So, this goes from a life-threatening gunshot to a story I'll tell my grandkids someday. With no need to exaggerate, that was a tough fight on Habitat 7. <laughs> Just glad to be on the other side of it. You and me both. Greer. Greer, how you feeling? Grateful. If you and Liam hadn't found me in that cave, God knows what those aliens would have done. We couldn't leave a man behind. Yeah, your father. Kirkland. It's a risky job. I know. It's rough. Being on the Pathfinder team is turning out to be a dangerous business. More than I ever thought. I'm sorry I'm not out there with you, but Kirkland was a friend. And I'm not cut out for this anymore. Understood. Habitat 7 was a nasty wake-up call. You take care, Greer. You too. Thanks again. No problem. Alright. We shall find out who the sabotager is. And then we'll make our way to uh, Eos. And then I'll get to the ship. We'll stop there. Ah, uh, did I already? This file is useless. Let's check another. Scary page two. And another scrambled file. Coincidence seems unlikely. Let's check another. This file is also corrupted. Definitely not a coincidence. You need pretty high clearance to mess with the security camera files. Somebody working for Kandros, maybe. That is the most probable scenario. Think you can get enough out of the files to find a match using biometric scans, Sam? The files were badly scrambled, but if I combine all the available identifiers, it might work. Based on the limited information available, we are looking for a human male, assigned either to the Nexus or Hyperion. You will need to conduct scans from close proximity. Got it. Scans. Scan people on op center, scan Nexus security transferred to the... This person is not a match. Alright. Match. And scan Nexus security transferred to the. Mmm. They won't. Oh, uh, don't. They will sabotage the ship then. Oh, how dare you! There's no way in hell I'm letting you do that. Security guard. Scan results show a partial positive. Target is most likely suspect. Who is he? Dale Atkins reports to Kandros's department, assigned to station security. 
confront Dale. Well, can I see another option? Alright, just want to make sure. Partial. Well then. Dale Atkins, right? We need to talk. Look, not to be rude, but I have work to do. I don't think so. We know what you've been up to. You're done here. I... I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just doing my job, that's all. Proof says you've been up to no good. Vigors. Screw this. Screw all you hypocrites on this station. You weren't here when they kicked out our loved ones. Mutiny? We just wanted answers. My sister is out there. I don't even know if she's alive or... I sympathize. Your sister's out there, huh? But you're gonna kill thousands of people, including 20k on my ship, so... Whatever happened back then, hurting people now makes no sense. What do you know? I don't care what you think. The mutiny leaders were right to demand to know what was going on. You could have hurt people. Killed them. Like those who got killed when the leadership had the Krogan stomp on my friends? I'm done talking. I confess, it was me. Do whatever you want. Not up to me. Not my call. The Nexus leaders will make that decision. That lot make a decision? That'll be the day. Oh, he's just gonna walk away just like that? Viability. What does that mean? Alright, well, I guess that's it for that. Assume the worst. Let's hope your sister's alive, but assume the worst. All right. Find a way to remove. We'll start with the father's office, right? Pathfinder, Captain Dunn said to seal your father's cabin from anyone but you. It's open now. Thank you. Ooh. Can I have all this? Your father's first sidearm, a memento of his early Alliance service. I bet that saw plenty of action. Alex's first kill occurred in combat during the First Contact War. Back when Turians were the enemy. Crazy times. Oh, hey! What the hell? Memory trigger? Sam? What was that? An eidetic trigger, related to your father, and the portions of my memory array he locked. What triggered it? Alec tied it to your progression as Pathfinder, not to a location. Puzzling as it may be, my programming is clear. Locating more of these triggers will unlock the memories. One of your father's memories is now accessible. Return to Sam Node on the Hyperion to investigate further. Okay. <laughs> coffee machine mom got for dad he was so busy designing you needed the caffeine I did not realize I owed my existence to a bean <laughs> now you know what humility feels like archive system what's on here Sam your father's personal logs several of them are encrypted all right that log is not currently accessible unlocking my memory array may enable it all right general logs File entry. Dunn's agreed to a scouting mission on Habitat 7. I'm gearing up now. I'm worried about Scott. Dr. Tapero says he'll be fine, but he's my son. How can I not worry? I hate to leave him like this. It's these moments when you wish you told your children you love them more often. Or ever. Which brings me to the tough part. Kids. If anything happens to me, there are things you're going to find out. I hope you'll understand. All right. 
Sam node. Rider, the blocks your father placed on my array are opening. I can now recall specific memories which Alec wanted you to see. Wait, I can actually see his memories? Yes, you will experience them via your implant. Okay, something new every day. Play the memory. Let's see it. This memory is from the time when your father was posted on the Citadel. Alec, your recommendations will never fly. Artificial intelligence? It's our best option. If the Council gets wind of this, it'll set humanity standing back decades. You're overreaching. Ambassador Goyle, I'm the military attaché on the Citadel. My mandate is clear. Find an edge for Earth. And AI is your answer? We need to catch up. The Asari, the Salarians, they're centuries ahead of us. Uh, but it's illegal. Their rules, not ours. Why deny Earth an advantage? Define this advantage. It will set us free. We're prisoners of our own five senses. There's a reality greater than ours that we can't perceive, but an AI can. How? By augmenting our own abilities and adding a few new ones. Well, none of that stopped those Geth from revolting. Because they were separate from their creators. But AIs and humans interface directly, experiencing the world together, benefits both. There's no creator to revolt against. I'm sorry, Alec. We can't take the risk. I appreciate your work, but your request will be denied. As expected. <sighs> Alec? Ellen, what did the doctor say? He told me to appreciate the time I have left. There's no cure, Alec. It's terminal. Not on my watch. Well. Wow, hearing mom again. I never knew that's how dad found out. Alec was a stubborn man. Mom's life was at risk. It was just his way. It's how dad was wired. He didn't like to lose. In any situation. It would seem that included me. Nobody wanted to listen. The idea of you scared people too much. After this, Dad moved us back to Earth to care for Mom. Wonder why he wanted me to see this. Perhaps it was the beginning. Of what? Unknown. Private audio logs are now available in your father's quarters. I detect additional memories, but they are currently locked. They may yet hold answers. Okay, I'll keep working on it. All right, Sam's abilities. What are your capabilities? Each arm houses a Sam, simulated, adaptive, matrix. Each is an artificial intelligence designed by Alec Ryder to support Pathfinders and their teams. Oh, well. But AI is illegal in the Milky Way. How'd my dad get around that? Exceptions were made. The initiative deemed his research vital to the mission. Our design was conducted in secret. So there are other Sams out there? Correct. However, your father continued to modify my own routines until the Hyperion's departure. Ooh. I am the most advanced Sam in the initiative. Nice. That's all for now. Of course. Alright, uh, family secrets. Oh, whoops. Your father's personal logs. Ellen's disease. Amazing how life can change in an instant. Suddenly my career doesn't matter. This incredible woman I've been married to all these years. She's facing the end. All I think about are the times I wasn't there for her. Well, that's going to change. It occurs to me that Sam might be more than I ever imagined. All right. Oh, well, gotta save that. Whew, spend quite a bit of time here. Anyway, inventory, no. Family secrets, search for memory triggers, missing arcs. 
go to your ship. I suppose that's all. That's pretty much it. The murder scene, the missing arcs, additional tasks, the lost brother, Eos. There's that. Complete the missions. Don't care. Let's go to our ship, and we'll set up for Eos. I guess we go to the docking bay. Ooh, laggy. Ready to see what Tan gave us? I hear it's something special. Pathfinder en route. How's the ship? In final checks, looking great. We won't be long. The way things are going, we'll be on our own out there. In other words, we're making this up as we go. <laughs> We used to call that tactical improvisation. But at least we'll be doing it in style. They call her the Tempest. That is a fine ship. Go take a closer look. Let's pick it up a bit, people. We're 14 months late. So you're the one who's making everything happen. Vetra. Vetra Nix. Initiative Wrangler, Provisioner, Gunner, and everything in between. I like you. Are we ready? The sooner we get out of here, the better. You're coming with us? Yes. Otherwise, there's no way they're letting this ship off the station. <laughs> uh, huh. Are you gonna be as good as Garrus? Because I love Garrus. What's the rush? Just don't want to waste any more time. Hold it, hold it. You're not going anywhere. Damn it. I didn't do it. Is there a... <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Is something wrong? Director Addison wants to see a complete report of the Tempest supplies, munitions, and crew. Director Tan overruled Addison. The ship's loaded out with equipment for outpost discovery, squarely under Director Addison's purview. Seen you around. Ben, right? Came here with a family, didn't you? Son still in cryo? I could pull some strings, get him to the front of the line. Really? Yeah, really. They told me he wasn't essential, but I miss him. I know. I got family too, Ben. It's done. <sighs> Addison's gonna kill me. Smooth. Nicely done. Part of the job, Pathfinder. All things considered, it was an easy ask. Right now, you need people tearing down obstacles, not putting up more. Thank you. Finally, someone who cares about doing stuff and not just talking about it. Well said, Cora. <sighs> so, how do we do this exploration thing? <laughs> My first thing is Eos. Uh, what the hell? Did it, uh... Did it freeze? Oh god, hold on a second. I think it froze. 